Shalom Israel. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakak Wadash, the honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. And uh, hey, Shalom to the elect, man. Now you see on the screen here, you know, it's a semi, I guess you're going to call it a nice day. You know, it's not raining, which has been raining a lot lately, which is expected because it's spring. And, um, you know, I just want to make this quick video, man. Because, you know, people may, uh, you know, people want, may want to know, or, or, you know, may have the question of why y'all always complaining, you know? And the spirit just hit me, man. Well, even, even on a so-called nice day, I'm talking about the weather, you know what I'm saying? Esau is fucking spraying chemtrails, man. You know, so you can't even enjoy the day, man. And, um, you know, as I'm driving or whatever ahead of me, let me see if I could just, uh, real quick. I don't know if brothers see the sky, but it's like hazy or whatever. You know, I don't know if brothers can see that, but it's hazy. All right. You know, so even on a so-called nice day, Esau's a hey, hey. shoot with chemtrail, so lock it. One second. Esau's shooting chemtrails, man. It's a, you see the one on the left, it's thick ass piece of chemtrails, man. A long ass line of chemtrails, man. Alright, which just has all types of chemicals in it to make you sick. You know? And it's no, you know, it's no coincidence that Esau's going heavy right now. You know that he's pushing the measles outbreak. You know that he's pushing, uh, you know, it's flu season, get your flu shot. I wonder why, you know, at the same time, what the hell is flu season? Where's that in the scriptures, man? You know, that's why the scriptures say, seek ye out the old paths, man. Seek ye out the old ways and you will, you will know, man. All right. We just lived off the land in the, in, 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 the, in the ancient world, man. You know, we just, hey, where was the uh, scriptures about surgery, man? about cancer there's no scriptures about that man because the ancient world was way more healthier and better for us man you know so even on a so-called good day you know you still got to deal with chemtrails all right our people still on the bottom all right so in, in essence there really are no good days in babylon the great man you know you know this place is slated for destruction and that's another reason, yet another reason why Babylon the Great, also known as America, is slated for destruction. All right, because it does nothing but destroy. You know, this is the place where it says our people, our people were uh, spirit. This is the place uh, where it's known as spiritually Sodom and Egypt. All right, and both of those places were, hey, Sodom was destroyed, and this place is going to be destroyed in like manner, man. You know. And in Egypt, you know, it's spiritual because in Egypt, that was the place where our people didn't know their Heavenly Father, man. That was the place where they found him too. All right? Through the Lord's servant Moses. And that's where the place, this is the place where our people found Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah through his servants, the prophets. All right? Starting off with our apostles and elders, man. But really, they're elders, man. You know? Really, their elders, man, because they started, you know, this thing off. You know, high priest Alba Bivens, Elder Aria, Elder Yaikwab, Elder Masha. You know, hey, man, but you know, just a quick sum in the spirit. Um, something I was thinking about in the spirit, man. Amos 9 and 8. Surely the Lord God, all right, hey, his eyes is upon a sinful kingdom known as Babylon the Greek. You know. This is Esau. Esau Edom is a, a rule in the sinful kingdom, man. You know, and in, in our kingdom, there will be no chemtrails. We're going to know what an actual blue sky looks like, man. You know? The air is going to feel great, man. It's not going to feel heavy. The water is not going to be in plastic bottles, man. You know? You're not going to have to worry about buying water. You know? Buying food. Why? All right? Because in our kingdom... You're going to be able to grow it, man. You'll be able to grow it in your backyard. All right? And for you Israelites, 
Like the scriptures say in Deuteronomy 28, which you Israelites consist of you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. All right? For you Israelites, the scriptures say in Deuteronomy 28, like between 1 and 15, all right? It says, blessed shall be thy storehouse, man, and, and thy fields, man. You know, we're going to basically plant a seed, and the orchard is going to grow, man. You know, so we're going to be blessed beyond our wildest dreams, which is why we should be pushing for Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah to come back. All right. You know, this is for the elect. You know, this is good news ultimately for all of Israel. But at this point, only the elect is going to view this as good news. The destruction. All right. Of our captivity. All right. Because this is our captivity, man. You get up every day to an alarm clock on a plantation that you're scared to take off of work because you're scared. You know what I'm saying? You're going to get fired. All right. Your bills and. All types, hey, just all types of uh, misery and stress befalls us in this place, man. You know, this place is a, is a uh, horror story for you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. And yeah, I said Hispanics and Native Americans because, hey, you're getting shot down in the streets too. There's stories about that, but people, there's even stories to, to where they say, why aren't people talking about the killings of the Hispanics and the Native Indians, man? You know, because you are Israelites too. As a matter of fact, you went to slavery before the so-called Africans. The reason why they went to slavery, all right, well, it's all the same reason because they, you know, transgressed the law, statutes, and commandments. So, how about Shimei was shot? All right, but when you look into history, it said the reason why they took the blacks into slavery is because the uh, the northern, the so-called Hispanics and natives, you know, they were hey, they were being slaughtered off at a, at a uh, alarming rate. You know, so they needed so-called fresh meat, you know, and then Judah being, a, uh, you know, stronger or whatever, you know, they made for better slaves, man. But we all slaves and we all need uh, 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 salvation, man. That's Yahweh shot, man. Now the scriptures say in Matthew 121, he shall redeem his people from their iniquities, man. You know, so we need redemption from this world, man. Don't be, you know, fool. You know, yeah, it's. You know, the earth is beautiful, man. The scriptures call it Eden. All right. But um, another name for the earth is Eden. You know, but this earth, this, well, this portion of the earth, let me add, because not the whole earth is not going to be destroyed. But this portion of the earth will be. Okay. Hey, man. So, Shalom to the elect.